Hello, students. Good evening. Hello. Good evening, teacher. How are you today? Very well. Very well. Did you enjoy the weather yesterday? The rain, that? What? Did you enjoy the rain yesterday? No. <laughs> no, you say, <laughs> why not? You don't like the rain. <laughs> okay, so yesterday it was raining very hard. At least here near my house, it was very hard. I don't know, near your houses. But here it was terrible. Well, so today we are going to keep on working on the topic that we have been studying. What has been our topic for the week? What has been the topic of the week? Uh -huh. Our friend, what? Good evening. Hi, good evening. The topic for the week has been past tense, right? Your friend, the past. It has been a little bit complicated, but not impossible. Okay, so yesterday we were talking about the pronunciation of the past. I am very sorry that I think I didn't send you the page, right? Regañenme. No se las envié ver. No, teacher, you didn't. I am very sorry. I have so many things in my head. Well, but I, but I remember that I didn't send it and I was like, ah, I didn't send the page, I said. But it was like 11.30 and it was like, mm, maybe it's too late, I said. And today the day was very crazy, so. Never I, is too late to send. It. And nobody matching at midnight? Yeah, the day could be the start of the night. It doesn't matter. <laughs> it's the teacher, you say, hmm, hmm. like, bye bye from this world. And no, I, I rather <laughs> know. I am going to send it to you right now. And for sure, you are going to keep it there on your, um, on your WhatsApp, okay? So I am going to do it as soon as I finish with the classes, I'm going to send you the page for you to review. Well, so let's start today. Today, we are going to start our class by practicing a little bit of the past. Tell me, I am going to ask you a question again, but now you are going to tell me different activities about what you did today in your day. And I say, how was your day? And I say, well, today I went to work, I studied, I cleaned the house, I helped my, uh, my kid, uh, today I worked a lot and today I cook dinner. That was my day. How was your day? And for this one, I am going to send you to work in little groups. We are going to have a little conversation with your friends. Taking into account that we are just a few, we are going to go to two groups. And in these two groups, you are going to share with your friends a little bit about what you did today. Van a compartir un poquito de su día, pero todo en past tense, okay? I don't want to listen to you. I am going to go, I went to go, no. I did, I went, I cooked, I read, I cleaned, right? Everything in past, at least four or five activities each. Okay, so let's go to work in your group and I am going to go and listen to you in a moment. There you have the invitation accepted and then we are going to go and share for everybody. There you go. There you have your invitation accepted, please. And we're going to share a little bit about our day. I have David, there you go, Ingrid, Noemi. 
Ingrid, did you receive the invitation to go to the groups? Very good. Ingrid, did you accept the invitation? There you go. So right now, all of them are in the different groups discussing a little bit about what they did today. This is a little practice for them to um, go and review past tense. So we are going to go and check a little bit of what they are doing. Let's go to the groups right now. Hello. Cuatro. Four or five. Okay. Cuánto silencio, cuánto silencio. Vamos a hacer las, eh, vamos a hacer un listado de las actividades a diario, ¿verdad? No, no, no. Only for today. What did you do today? You are going to share about the activities that you did today, only today, the activities that you did today. I cleaned the house, I ate breakfast, I danced, I exercised, right? Different activities that you did today. Todas las que hicieron ahora. Todas las actividades que hicieron ahora. Lo mínimo, unas cinco. Okay? Go ahead. Okay. Excuse me, teacher. Yes? No le escucho, no sé si los demás escuchan. ¿Me escuchan five, los demás? Yo sí escuché. Five activities today. Ok, Noemi, ¿no le escucha a nadie o solo a mí? Charán. Hello. Ajá, ajá, vamos a probar aquí el audio de Noemi. Hoy sí ya me escuchan. Yes, yo, yo, yo sí. Yo sí. Ok, vamos a ver aquí con Noemi. Active su audio, Noemi, please. Hoy sí ya, ya. me escucha. Yes, sí. Bueno, ya. Ahí la desactivé y la volví a activar. Thank <laughs> There you. you go. Okay, so uh, go and share with your group about your activities of the day. Go ahead. I am going to go and check the other group. Tenemos que saber qué fue lo que hizo cada uno. Yes. <laughs> okay. Yes. <laughs> okay. Exactly like that. It's just a little review of what you did today. Julio, ¿yo estás? Hola. Buenas noches. Hola, Yanni. Aquí estoy, pero me acabo de incorporar. Estaba, estaba haciendo algo de trabajo. ¿Qué okay. vamos a hacer? Ok, what you are going to do is that you are going to share uh -huh. a couple of activities of what you did today. So you're going to give a little summary of your day. Five or six activities. Cinco, seis actividades que hizo hoy. In oh. past tense, yes. Ah, in past tense, okay. Yes. Go ahead. Please, can you just stand? No, it's very silencious, I know. Yes. Let's see. Any, many, many more. Any, many, many more. David. <laughs> you yeah. know, that is, that is the thing, Marin, in English. When you say, any, many, many more. Any, many, many more. And that's it, like, thing, Marin, that's it. Any, many, many more. Teacher. Teacher. Uh-huh. Teacher, one question. Yes. <laughs> ¿Cuál es el, el, el pasado de Cares? ¿De what? Cares. What is that? In, in... A, a, acariciar. Um, depending. If it is for an animal, it's sí. I, I pet. I pet my dog, you say. 
I pet my dog is like when you are like, oh, my little dog and everything. I, that's, I, that's, I pet my dog. Pet. Pet. P-E-T. Uh-huh. I pet my dog. Pet is like como chinchinear. Uh-huh. Jugar con él. It's like, nin, 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 nin. <laughs> I pet my dog. Okay, gracias. Yes, okay, very good. Hello, Wilfredo. Hello, Cesar. Welcome. We are going to listen to our friends sharing because you have a, a little time here. So please, Ana, David, Jorge, Julio, and Janita, you can start sharing. Go ahead. Hi, Simon. Yes. Hi, Simon. Go ahead. Okay. Uh huh. Very good. Continue. I, I went to work. Perdón. I went to work today. I went to work. I visited my grandmother. Yo tengo, yo tengo dos. I, I am about both. At I vote. In the afternoon. So you say, I vote. I vote. I vote. Because if you say I'm I am both, you have two verbs. I am and okay. I vote. I I vote at the morning in the afternoon. Very good. I went to the I doctor. went shopping at the supermarket. I went shopping to the supermarket. Good. I started for the past day. Very good. I went to work. I went to work. I went to work. Very good. I had breakfast. I had breakfast. Very good sentence. Write a couple more because we are going to go back in a moment. Mm. A couple of more sentences and we're going to finish. I do my, my homework. My homework in singular. My homework. I do my homework. Very good. I took a shower. Very good. I took a shower, very good. Yesterday when it was raining. I went to shop. I went to shop, you, you go shopping a lot. <laughs> I got up early, I took a shower. I got up early, very good. I got up early, me levanté temprano, very good. Okay. I, I took a shower, you say. Tengo otra. I went to a court. I went to a court, to uh, La Cancha. No, go, trabajo. Ah, I went to work, to work. Sí, I yes, I went to work. To go. Or I worked. Car. Which one? I drove a car. I drove a car, very good. Another one. I run in the in the stadium. Okay, run is an irregular verb. That is, uh, it doesn't change. So you say, so uh, it's a, as it is irregular. It has its own form, and you say, I ran hmm. at the stadium, right? I ran. I ran. Okay, very good. Okay. So let's finish because we're going to go back to the main session, okay? There. 
Okay, so welcome back, my dear groups. And I heard that you were sharing a little bit about what you did on your day. And there was a group who was collecting sentences from everybody to create one complete paragraph. And that's very excellent. So we are going to ask, uh, let me see, Juan Eduardo. And I am going to ask, uh, let me see, Wilfredo from the other group. Juan Eduardo is going to be the representative of group one. And Wilfredo is going to be the representative for group number two. What activities do you remember from your friends? What activities do you remember from your friends? Juan Eduardo starts. Yeah, teacher, ¿cómo tendría que decir? Como, como mi amigo hizo. Ah, o, o, you o can yo. say, we. In order to make ah, it no, general, sorry. yes, we. Ah. We, uh -huh. and then you use the, the normal form of the verbs. If you say, for example, we ate breakfast, we took a shower, we went to school, and then you complete the sentence. Try with one or two. Intente con una, dos o tres, y aquí lo apoyamos. Okay, okay. Uh, digamos, we visited. Uh -huh. Uh, my teacher. We visited my teacher. Yes, we had a very good, nice time. Bien rico el almuerzo. <laughs> we visited the teacher. Good. Another sentence. Uh, <laughs> Let me see. Another person from group one who can help him. El Elmer, Mauricio, can you help Juan? Hey teacher, uh, in the group, uh, uh, we visited my grandmother. Very good. We went to work. Very good. We had a breakfast. We had breakfast, good. We did homework. We did homework, excellent. We took a shower. <laughs> yeah, not together, okay. <laughs> Yes, 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 yes. We were separate. <laughs> okay. Yes, yes. In the swimming pool, in the swimming one, pool. One, one, one for one. <laughs> one by one. Yeah, in a line. <laughs> continue, continue. We went, you know, we drove a car. We ran a stadium. We ran at the stadium, right? We ran at, at the, the stadium. stadium. Okay. Good. Okay, and okay, very, good. very good. Group number eight claps for group number one. Very nice. Yeah, the representatives of group number one. Mira, Kiara del Carmen. <laughs> este mi perro me está hablando la extensión. Okay. <laughs> That's her name, uh, Kiara del Carmen. Pues no, no le ladra, but. No. Okay. That, that's her name. <laughs> it's, it's a little animal. I am going to show it to you. Come here. Show it. You will see. It's a little baby. My goodness. She's beautiful. <laughs> she knows English. <laughs> yeah. But she's always here. Every night she's here listening to the class. But she is like a little kid. Y ahí anda como que niño chiquito. Me da vueltas así en todo el escrito. Well, you see, I fought with my dog today. I fought, yeah, with my dog. For group number two, I am going to have Mr. Uh, Julio, I said, right, as a representative. Yes, go ahead, my dear representative for group number two. Um, we work to work in the morning. Very good. Um, we, we drink coffee. We drank coffee. We drank coffee and talk about life. <laughs> that's that's interesting. <laughs> okay. Only teacher. 
we drank coffee and we talk about life. Imagine you're like, Workable. yeah, life is difficult. Yes, I, <laughs> I know. Yeah, I agree. Yeah, me too. And that's it, right? Pero quienes somos nosotros? <laughs> Reflexionamos. Yeah, thinking, thinking about life. That is nice. It's very useful. Well, today we're going to finish with this section talking about past events. Thank you very much. Group number two, I am going to send you hearts as well. Very nice job on sharing your sentences. So we are going to keep on practicing a little bit about the sentences. And remember that we have been working in affirmative, negative, and interrogative. If you have the opportunity to ask me a question with did, how will you create the sentence? How will you create the question? And you say, teacher, did you send me the document? Yes, I did. I sent you the document. Yeah, it's on your WhatsApp. It's a lie. Yes, I sent it to you. So don't call and be like, in this moment. <laughs> <laughs> but I sent it, I sent it. So if you can, if you can create questions, how would you do it? How would you create a question for your teacher? Teacher, did you? And then you create the question. Uh-huh, questions, create questions. We need to tell you the, the question. Teacher, or going did to you work. have a dinner? Did you have dinner? No, <laughs> not today. Uh. I cooked dinner, but I didn't eat it. I left it there after class. Okay. <laughs> yes, any other question? Did uh -huh. you oh, to the did, did you like, like avocado? <clears throat> did you like avocado when I was a kid? Yes. When you say did you like avocado, le gustaba, right? Did you like avocado when you were a kid? Uh, I don't know when you were pregnant, when you were I don't know sick, when you had COVID. I don't did, know. You, did you have? Do you have a child? Yes, I do. I have one. One little, oh. one little four-year-old kid. <laughs> I look very okay. young. No. <laughs> it's because I never noise the voice. No, no. As as I I have always been a teacher. I mean, his four years of life, he has seen me teaching. So he knows and he says, like, shh, my mama's in class. He says. <laughs> Yes, that's what he says. And he goes. He's a good boy. He's a good boy, definitely. Yeah. Question. Hey, teacher, did you go to the museum last night? Yeah, let me see. No, I didn't go to the museum last night. I had a class. Okay. Question. Teacher. Did you yeah, dance yeah, with yeah. her pet? <laughs> <laughs> yes, I did. Today in the morning. I always dance with Yara. She loves to dance. Question. Teacher, did you go out with your friends? Today, no. I didn't go out today. Because as I don't work today, today is my day off. I stay home. I didn't do anything. Good. So for the questions, thank you very much for all the questions that I have. And we can see that we put the auxiliary did at the beginning, then you put the subject, and then you put the verb, right? After this. Insisto, tengo un vecino. Acabo de oír el mismo trueno. Okay. <laughs> okay. So... In this one, you have, I did my homework. I didn't do laundry. What are you going to do right now? We are going to do a little exercise. And for this one, I need you all to pay attention because you are going to continue the sentence of the other person. I am going to tell one sentence and you are going to tell me, no, teacher, you didn't do that. You did this. And I am going to change it. Imagine that I say, today I dance. And you say, no, teacher, today you didn't dance. Today you, 
slept. And I say, e no, I didn't sleep. Anna sleep. And Anna says, no, today I didn't sleep. I cook. And Elba can say, no, you didn't cook. You took a shower. And you are going to be denying the sentence of the other person. Let me see. Today, I went to the supermarket. No, teacher. No, teacher. You no, teacher. went to the bank. <laughs> no, no, I didn't go to the bank. Carlos went to the bank. And you say, no, I didn't go to the bank. No. I did this. <laughs> <laughs> he Carlos. didn't go to the bank. He um, worked. He worked. Uh, no, he didn't work. Elba worked. And Elba says, today I didn't work. I cleaned the house, you say. Uh -huh. Defiéndase de la mentira. <laughs> Elba went to the bank today. Oh. I didn't go to the bank. You didn't go to the bank. I. I. And invent something else. I went to. I went to shop. <laughs> okay. No, you didn't go shopping. <laughs> Julio went shopping. No, I didn't know shopping. I was to work. Ah, he went to work. No, you didn't go to work. David went to work. Oh, he didn't go to work. I visited the gas station. He visited the gas station. No, you didn't visit the gas station. Jenny visited the gas station. No, I didn't visit, it. visit the gas station. I went to the swimming pool. You went to the swimming pool. No, that's not true. I saw Eduardo in the swimming pool. I didn't swimming. I didn't go. I didn't go to, to swimming pool. Uh -huh. I I played I played uh, football at stadium. You play football at the stadium. Mm, that's not true. I saw Jorge playing soccer at the stadium. So Jorge played soccer at the stadium. No, teacher. Uh, I didn't no, play soccer in the stadium. I walked to the park. You walked to the park. No, that's not true because the one that was in the park was Elmer. Elmer with Daisy. I saw you at the park. No, teacher. I didn't walk to the park. I drove a car. Uh -huh. And Daisy, I saw you in the park with Elmer. No, I didn't go to the park. I go visit doctor. I went. I went visit the doctor. Ah, uh -huh, Dr. Elmer. <laughs> you went, you remember, do you remember Dr. Elmer? ¿Te acuerdan del Dr. Elmer que nos estaba ahí curando? <laughs> that was good. Good, very good. So you didn't go, uh -huh, you went to visit the doctor. But I remember that Juan Eduardo went to the doctor. No, I didn't. I started my homework in English. I started oh, his English homework. Mm, you didn't start your English homework. Evelyn did the homework. <clears throat> Evelyn, you see, she's doing the homework. <laughs> Hello. Hello, Evelyn. You did the English homework. And tell me, no, teacher, I didn't do the English homework. No, no teacher, I not didn't. I didn't do. I didn't do. The English homework. The English homework. Now give me another activity that you did. Um, I did I 
Oh, I couldn't listen to you. No te puedo entender porque se te oyó bien cortado. Oh, my God. I, I understand. So, she went dancing in the rain. Yay. No, she was not dancing in the rain. I saw Carlos dancing. Carlos was dancing. I didn't. I didn't. I didn't, I didn't know dancing. Teacher. Uh -huh. You didn't I, dance. What did you do? I... I go. I, I, I go. Better the day. Okay, you drove the car. You drove. Okay. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. He drove today. All today. Okay, he drove the car all the day. Well, I think you didn't. You didn't drive the car. I think Noemi drove the car. No, teacher. I didn't drive the car. I went to the pharmacy. Oh, you went to the pharmacy with Daisy, right? <laughs> okay, my dear students, very good job. Very good job surviving on the sentences. Very nice. So, so, so. That, that was so, so. It's good because you have to be very careful with your ear, right? Ana Mendoza, can you help us read the sentences that I have on the picture? And I am going to share it right now. The one that I am sharing right ah, now. Ah, sorry, sorry. Bye -bye. There you go. <clears throat> Can you help me to read the sentences that you have there? All or only number one? Uh, the first three, these ones. Okay. I did my homework. Very good. I didn't do laundry. You got up at noon. You didn't get up at 10 p.m. 10 o'clock. At 10, so, you say 10. I think. Uh, he went to the museum. He didn't go to the library. To the library, very good. To, to the, the library. library. Very nice. Okay. Now, let's go with, a, let me see. I am going to ask a girl to do this. Marisol, can you help me to read the other three? Okay, teacher. Uh, we meet our classmates. We met. We met our classmate. We didn't meet our teacher. Very good. You came uh, you came home late. Very good. You didn't come home early. Very good. They had a picnic. They didn't have a party. Very good job. Excellent job, Marisol, on reading the sentences, right? They had a picnic, they didn't have a party. So in this case, we have the contrast of affirmative and negative sentences. And what we are going to do right now, we're going to practice a little bit more on the creation of sentences, right? Here we have a sentence in the normal form, right? In the present form. And we are going to transform the sentence into past tense. In this one, we have, for example, he goes to bed early. He went to bed early, right? Because you transform go for went, right? He went to bed early. In this one, we don't like onions. We didn't like onions, right? And this is past negative. If we have the next one, a steward lives in Vancouver. What are we going to transform? A steward lives in or Vancouver? Lives. Lives. What are we going to use? Live. 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 Okay, so what are what is the sentence going to be? To live in Vancouver. In Vancouver. Very good. The steward lived in Vancouver. What about the next one? Does she exercise? What is the sentence going to be? Did. Did she, did she, she exercise? Did she exercise? Very good. Did she exercise? What about number five? I hate cooking. I hate, I hate cooking. Cook. Cook. What is the main verb here? ¿Cuál creen que es el verbo principal aquí? I hate cooking. Hate, hate right? The hate. main verb is hate. 
So hey. you are going to transform hate and you say, I hey. hated hey. cooking. Okay. But now I love it because it's an obligation, right? <laughs> I hated cooking. The next one, they play video games. What is the past tense of this sentence? Play. They play. play. They play. They play. They played video games. They played video games. Video games. Video games. Video games. What about the next one? He knows the answer. He knew no. the answer. He knew. He knew, he knew, knew. right? Knew, knew. Because knew. that is the form. He knew the answer. Yes. He knew the answer. What about the next one? I forget his name. Forgot. I forgot, I forgot his name. His name. His name. His name. I, I forgot, forgot his name. Mm. The next one. They don't study history. They didn't. They, they didn't, didn't study, study history. history. Very good. They didn't study history, right? History. What is the difference between history and a story? Uh -huh. ¿Cuál es la diferencia entre history y story? The story is tienda, no. Tienda. <laughs> no. <laughs> English. English. You have an idea. Good, good, good. What is the difference? Eh, historia es como el que se va transmitiendo de generación en generación. Uh -huh. Y historia es que queda plasmado con referente a algo que ya pasó en un tiempo determinado. It was very close, very close, but the idea is good. History is, fa is based in facts, right? Tiene hechos, situaciones marcadas con datos y todo. Ah, sí. And a story can be invented, <laughs> right? A story. A story a as the, the tale. Exactly, a story similar to a tale, but English has a very good idea of the difference, right? Thank you, English, very good. Here, history. Es todo, vea. Allá en 1900, no sé cuánto, en El Salvador, blah, 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 blah. That's history, right? But if I say, hey, students, huh? today in the morning, you see, I went to the supermarket and two ladies were fighting there because of some tomatoes. That's a story. <laughs> that's I am what telling you. That's, get you that, that's the reason that you forget send the list. You see, because I was there. Checking the chambre, right? No, that's the difference between uh, history and story. Good. Dato curioso de grammar. Very good. And do they drive? Did they drive? Did they drive? Did they drive? Did they drive? Very good. So in this one, as you can see, it was kind of easy, right? Because I was helping you and you were helping each other. But now we are going to work individually. Right, we're going to work individually and you are going to complete the sentences on your own. Okay, mm -hmm. I need you to choose five sentences. Choose five. Escojan cinco. Puede ser esta, 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 y esta, or the ones that you want. Okay, choose five sentences and write them on your notebook in past. Mm -hmm. Go ahead. Choose five sentences. Ahí entre ustedes se van a sacar los voluntarios para compartir. Oh my God. There you go.
Only five, okay? Only five. If you want to do the 10 sentences, that's okay, no problem. But I need five. Did you finish? If someone finished, you can share. Finish. Okay, Eduardo, go ahead. Um, mm -hmm. Do you swim? Did you swim? Did you swim? Very good. Where do you live? Where did you live? Where did you live? Uh -huh. Where did you live? I don't run fast. I didn't run fast. I didn't run fast. Very good. Do you enjoy sport? Did you enjoy sport? Very good. He doesn't drink tea. He didn't drink tea. Very good job. Excellent sentences, Mr. Eduardo. Very nice job. Another one who has finished? Finished, teacher. Go ahead, Elmer. Share your sentences. Only the past tense, OK? Okay. Did you swim? Where did you live? Very good. We didn't like the movie. Very good. He didn't dream. Tea. Very good. He had a car. He had a car. Had Very, a car. Very good job. He had a car. Excellent. Another volunteer? Thank you. Go on. Jenny works at a, a hotel. Very good. Uh, did you swim? Very good. We didn't like the movie. Yes. They start class at eight. They start till? Started. Started class at eight and he had a car. He had a car. Very good job. Excellent. Another volunteer. Volunteers. Me, uh, teacher. Okay, uh, Danny and then David. Okay. He worked at a hotel. Okay, Jenny worked worked at a hotel. Did he eat breakfast? Very good. I didn't run fast. I didn't run fast, very good. He had a car. He had a car, very good. Did you enjoy a sport? Did you enjoy sports? Very good job. Fantastic, thank you, Jenny, very good job. Mr. David, go ahead. The microphone's with it. There you go. Uh, now? Very, now we can <laughs> okay. listen to you. Okay. Did has a car? I did run fast. Did you swing? Where did you lie? Where did you live? I'm sorry. Where did you live? Did he eat breakfast? Did he eat breakfast? Good. He he had a car. He had a car. And okay. my final volunteer. Who is going to be my final volunteer? Me, teacher. Go ahead. Jenny worked at hotel. He didn't drink tea. Did he eat breakfast? Maybe. He had a car. Where did you live? Where did you live? Excellent job, Janita. Very nice. Very nice job. Someone else who wants to practice before we go? Practique ahora o practique en el siguiente ejercicio. <laughs> One more. Mr. Cesar Montesino, I haven't listened to your voice today. 
¿Me ha oído esa vocecita hoy? Mr. César. ¡Tirín! Mr. César Montesinos, le solicita en la clase. <laughs> okay, that's why I haven't heard Teacher, his voice. Only, yes. Only in past. Yes. Uh, the sentence. Okay. Yes. Go ahead. Uh, number one, Jenny worked at a hotel. Worked. Worked. Work. Number two, did do a swim. Very swim. good. Number three, we didn't like the movie. Very good. Number four, I didn't run fast. Very good. And number five, did you enjoy sports? Very nice job, Mr. Julio. Very good job. Very nice. It is important that you take the advantage to practice. Don't feel ashamed. Que si me equivoco, que se me voy feo, que no es que... Don't, don't worry about that. Take the opportunity to practice because, I mean, we need to take advantage of the moments, right? With uh, our practice. So here, I have some pictures about the things that happened today. And here we have Carol and Max. I need you please to create sentences about what happened in their days. You don't, know, you don't need to write them, just to create them. About Carol, she did something, but she didn't do the other thing. You have to decide which one is the affirmative and which one is the negative. I can say that Carol cleaned the house, but she didn't study. I mean, you can tell me, no teacher, she studied, but she didn't clean. And I said, mm, no, I think she didn't clean and she didn't study, right? Or you can say she studied and she cleaned. I don't know if you want to have two affirmatives, two negatives, one affirmative and one negative. Either way, I am going to uh, let you analyze the sentences, the pictures, sorry. And I am going to ask for uh, some people to give me the ideas that they have. I am going to ask Daisy, for Carol, Noemi for Max, Elba for Carol in the second picture, and Carlos for Max in the second picture, okay? Because we have one picture and the second picture, okay? So we are going to start here with Carol. What can you tell me about Carol? Daisy, go ahead. I, uh, she, uh, she, a uh, cleaning. She cleaned. Cleaning. And she read book. She cleaned she and book. she read a book. Read okay, book. she cleaned and she read a book. What about the next one, Max? Max, who is in charge of Max? ¿A quién le tocó el primer Max? Teacher. Go ahead. Yes. Yo no entendí si me tocaba Max o el, el otro de abajo, ¿cómo se llama? <laughs> no, this Max. Max. This Max. This one. <clears throat> okay, okay. Go ahead. Uh, Max play. Mm. Golf. Golf. <laughs> Play. Max play golf. Um, and Max walk, 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 walk in the park. Okay, Max play golf and Max walked in the park. Very good job. Let's continue with the other. Oh, sorry, sorry, sorry. We're going to continue with the other Carol. And I think this one is for. Elba, right? Carol is listening to music. Uh-huh. Um, and Carol Cook, right? Very good. Mr. Elmer, can you help us with uh, the other Max? Me, teacher. 
Ah, sí, Noemi, sí. Noemi, eh, yes, it was Noemi, <laughs> salvado por la campana. <laughs> Noemi, go ahead. Uh, watch TV. Mm -hmm. mm. Cook. Uh -huh. Cook. He didn't cook. He cook. What can you tell me about Max? Okay, Max, watch TV. Max, watch TV. Max, um, cooking. Cook, right? Cook. Max cooked. Very good. So, if you are going to give me the two sentences in negative, how will you make the first carol? The two negative. Everybody, can you help me with that? Ese es para todos. Si hiciera la, prim la primera Carol. de carol en negativa, ajá. Uh -huh. Carol didn't study. And Carol? And Carol didn't And Carol didn't clean the house. Very good. Carol is very lazy. What about Max? Negative. Max didn't play golf. And? He didn't walk in the park. What about? Carol, the second Carol in affirmative. The second Carol didn't listen. No, in affirmative, in affirmative. Ah, 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 oh, sorry. Uh, Carol, Carol, Carol listened listen. listen to music listen. and Carol? Listen. And Carol cook. Carol cook. Cook. The dinner. Cook. cook the dinner. The second Max in negative. Max. Max, Max didn't and watch TV. And he didn't watch TV. And he didn't cook the dinner. He didn't cook the dinner. He didn't cook the dinner, right? At the Max. For <laughs> <laughs> gusto. <laughs> he didn't cook the dinner. Okay. So we're going to go over a little conversation here. And it says, did you like it? Did you like it? And I am going to do the conversation with Mr. Julio. Help me with the conversation. And Ingris, Julio and Ingris. <coughs> Go ahead. Julio starts. Comienzo yo. Here, yes. So did you go anywhere last summer? Ingris? Yes, I did my sister. Yes, I did my sister. And I went to Arizona with Santa Grand Canyon. Okay, we saw the Grand Canyon, right? The Grand Canyon. The next really, one. Really? Did you like it? Oh, yes, we love it. Did you go hiking there? No, when the actuality were road horse okay. and were arson. Wet white water, plating of color right. Wow, did you have fun? Yes, we did. We have great time. Thank you very much. Thank you for the effort. Very nice. Thank you for the effort. That was very good. So I am going to work a little bit on pronunciation, okay? I am going to clarify a little bit of pronunciation, right? The Grand Canyon. The Grand Canyon. Grand Canyon. Hiking. Um, hiking. Hiking. hiking, we hiking. rode horses. Oh, horses. White water rafting. White, White water, water rafting. rafting. White water rafting. The Colorado River. Colorado. The Colorado River. So students, so did you go anywhere last summer? So. Oh. Did, did you, you go, go anywhere, go anywhere oh, last, last summer? summer? Yes, I did. Last summer? Yes, yes, I, I, did. Did. yes I, did. I did. My sister and I went to Arizona. My sister and I went to Arizona. We saw the Grand Canyon. We saw the Grand Canyon. Really? Did you like it? Really? Did, did, did you like, like it? it? Oh, yes, we loved it. Oh, yes. yes. Did you go hiking there? Did you go hiking there? No, we didn't. No, we didn't. Actually, we rode horses. 
And we also went white water rafting on the Colorado River. And we also went white water rafting on the Colorado River. Wow, did you have fun? Wow, oh, oh, did you have fun? Yes, we did. We had a great time. Yes, we did. We had a great time. We had a great time. We had a great time. So, here we have a question with Dil, right? Did you go anywhere last summer? Do you have any other question with Dil? Did you like it? Did you like, you like it? it? Very good. Another one? Did you go hiking there? 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 Another one? Did you have fun? Did you, Did have, you fun? have fun? Good. Negatives in past. Negatives in past that you can see in the conversation. Negatives. No we, no, we didn't. I went. No, we didn't. No, we didn't, right? This one. No, we didn't. That's the only one, right? Past tense sentences. Yes, I did. Yes, I did. Yes, I did, right? Yes, I did. My sister I and I went. My sister and I went. Another one? We saw the Grand Canyon. We saw the Grand Canyon. We love it. 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 We rode horses. We rode horses. We rode horses. We also went white water rafting. We also went white water rafting. Very good. And the last one? Yes, we did. Yes, we did. And we had a great time. We had a great time. As you can see, almost all the conversation was in past tense. The only thing that we have is the connectors, right? When you say yes, really, actually, and, right? But for, for the rest, all the conversation was in the past. <sighs> so here we go. And we're going to close up with this little explanation, right? This is what we have been studying, right? This is what we have been studying, the simple past, yes, no questions. When you have, did you have a good summer? Did you play volleyball? Did Erica like her vacation? Did Erica and her sister go to Colorado? In these ones, we don't have any other option for than, uh, further than yes or no, right? Because you have only, did you, did he, did she? And you say yes or no. Yes, she did. No, she didn't. And you can give extra information to the question, right? But you don't have that much to explain because I don't ask, where did you go on vacation? I say, did you go on vacation? Yes, I did, only that. But if I say, where did you go? Ah, I went to El Salvador. It's a beautiful place. And then you can start sharing more, right? But if I say only did, it's only for yes and no. So, um, I am going to show you the last exercise that we're going to do for the class, and I am going to let you go and sleep. So in this one, if you use the auxiliary deal, the verb is normal, remember. <clears throat> and I say, did you have a good summer? Yes, I? Yes, I did. Yes, I did. I? Oh, I agree. I, I oh, have... Oh. A great, a, summer. a great summer. I just, I just relaxed. 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 I just relaxed. And anywhere last summer? Did you go? Did you go? Very good. Did you go anywhere last summer? No, I? No, I didn't. No, I didn't. I stayed. I stayed here. But my friends... Is it me? And let's see. And on the weekends, we went out. We went out a lot. And the last one. Did you take? Did you take, did you take any class class last summer? Did you take any class last summer? And it says yes, I. Yes, I did. Yes, I did. Yes, I did. I, 
took, I took, I took tennis, tennis lesson. lesson. And I played tennis, tennis every day. Every day. Did you, did you, did you speak English last summer? No, I didn't. But I read English books. And I watch English movies. Very good job, my dear students. So for tomorrow, we are going to finish talking about the past tense, right? We are going to talk about the past tense and I need you to prepare a little paragraph about Christmas. Prepare a little paragraph about Christmas. What did you do on Christmas? Okay? Preparen un párrafo chiquito para mañana acerca de qué hicieron en Navidad. Because you're going to use it. Okay? What did you do on Christmas? Okay? So that is going okay. to be for tomorrow. Have a beautiful night, my dear students. Rest okay. a lot, and I'm going to see you tomorrow good for night. last night class. Night. Good, night. good night. Bye. Good night. Bye. Good night. Bye. Good night. Bye. Bye. See you. Bye, teacher. Bye-bye.